Hello everyone, my name is H2 and welcome back to All of Mods 8. Now today I have some big plans and those plans involve magic and this little mod, which I hope I'm pronouncing right, is Ars Nouveau. Scribe's Table, that's what I need. So I need two gold nuggets. Okay, it has to be Archwood Slabs and Archwood Log. Okay, I'm gonna grab some of the blazing. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What you said? Whoa. Crossbow. Elven crossbow. Streamline crossbow. A globe? I think if I can place that, you've got me sold, sir. You've got me sold. This is for your life. You stay here. I'm coming to pay up. Let me see it. Can I? I can, sir. You're in luck. Look at that can spin it and all it does is tell me my coordinates it's still cool it's still cool I like it I'm gonna try that uh oh uh oh uh oh uh oh I don't know how to not freeze how do I not freeze I didn't pick up anything from the blazing. Oh. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, now we know what not to eat. For now, that is. Uh, okay. Oh, I needed gold. I've been watching just a few other playthroughs of people uh, doing all the mods eight, just so I can figure out what other mods I can get into um and and one that i didn't know about actually is uh let's see i think it's in getting started storage chapter basic storage hang on where is it yeah basic storage so there's a sophisticated storage mod right next to the sophisticated backpacks and I just completely skipped over this. Take me some more experience. But yeah. Basic tier upgrade. There's an iron chest. <clears throat> so I think if I place this down and then I crouch, click on that, then it becomes a sophisticated um, chest and then I think with a little bit of iron well, I guess someone is making a create miner because I definitely don't want to go down with the pickaxe right now now I do later on in the series not not today and maybe not tomorrow either but what I want to do is set up a storage system. And from finding out sophisticated storage, I found out about refined storage, which, yeah, let's see, refined storage. And there's a bunch of stuff. So you got like storage monitors, which then requires us to get into processors and stuff like that. I don't even know how to craft all this. There's a disk drive, cables, Covers, wireless grid, security manager, detector, relay, network transmitter, network receiver, fluid grid, pattern grid, wireless transmitter, all all this stuff. Got a kitchen station? Kitchen access point? Oh, that's cool. Okay. So there's some really cool stuff here. Okay, so we got we got our gold. Let's do that. Do some of that, and we'll just do a wood axe. Place these two down, chop, chop. Okay, so it was one there, one there. Clamps across. Then one there and one there. Yes. The scribe's table. We got this here. How do I place it? Where do I? What's a good spot? Oh, okay. 
So that looks really cool, but we're gonna move it. I think I gotta stand here. Oh no, it had to go and be one of those. It's the only table that connects to these paper walls. Oh, uh, okay. So I think the next thing to do is, let's see, there's a book that comes with it. I think it's like the scribe spell book or something. Ah, novice spell book, that's what it was. So we need a book with every iron tool. So it looks like we're gonna need to do a little bit of mining sooner than I thought. Ooh, we gotta we gotta place our globe somewhere. Um put it right there. I kinda wish it spun by itself. That'd be neat. I've got the feeling that I need to set up a new mine. Something close. So I'm thinking right here. It's close, it's not on the island, and it's raining, so that's a plus. What is this? Nickel. I know I'll need it at some point. So let's just go ahead and grab it. Nice. Okay, so we got a Nurt Crystal Ore. Got some coal. There be some iron there. Here's some more here. More iron. And some more. Dimensional shard. I like the sound of that, it sounds important. And it was glowing, so you know. There they are. I knew they'd be here somewhere. Oh, there he is. I haven't seen you in a fair bit. Two hits. This is a big system. Okay, we'll just grab the last little bit that's here, and then we'll head out. Cause I, th I, th I think 40 will be good. Whoa! He's got a trident! He dropped the trident. He dropped the trident. I'll take the iron. <laughs> Streamlined trident of critical thinking. Ooh, thank you. <laughs> yeah, so a trident. That's cool. Now, we take the chest and we surround it in iron. Then we get an oak iron chest. And then when I place this down, look at how much we have. So one iron chest is the same size as just regular Double chest. So now we can have a lot more by name, by tags. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Hey, everyone. Just want to let you guys know that I am really close to 50 subscribers. And I thank you guys who are subscribed so much for that. Um, you guys have built up this channel from close to nothing to now nearing 50 subscribers. And I think that's totally crazy. So if you like my content and you are not subscribed, I ask that you please just take a few seconds to click that subscribe button down below. Um, just so that we can make it to the goal of 50 subscribers. I think that would be pretty awesome. Um, everything I put out is free. Nothing is paid for. I, I really, I really hate asking for this, but at the same time, we're just, we're really, really close uh, to the 50 subscriber goal. Um, so that's all I'm gonna ask. Thank you very much, and let's get back to the video. Eventually, we need to sort all of our chests by vanilla and mod, and then we can go from mod to sorting all bunch of different mods. Ooh, more notebook. This is the book. Okay, I need to make an iron frame. I need to make an item frame for this. So, okay. Spell casting. Ooh, that is a lot of reading to do. Okay, scribes table. Spell book on the table, open codex. Each glyph requires a set of items and experience points to unlock. Click a glyph by clicking, by clicking on it. 
in the menu and hit select. Throw the items onto the table as rendered above. There's all that. We can make our tools. So we need a shovel, an axe, a pickaxe, and a sword. Continuing from our achievement loss in the last episode. <laughs> there we go. And then, what was it? It was a book, wasn't it? Just, just a regular book. I could have just teleported over here. Not lazy. I'll tell you that much. It's loud, but it's fast. Now we place our enchanting table right in the middle. And I think you can go from a max of two blocks. Oh, does it not? I don't think it pulls from two blocks. <laughs> okay, so now I need to move this closer here. Right there. Now will it start pulling? Now it does, okay. Ah, oh, bummer. I thought it would pull from two. I thought it, look, I thought it wouldn't look weird. If I put a book in here. Backstabbing Bane of Anthropods and Reach One. Whoa, Eterna determines the available enchantment levels. Quanta, Pure Chaos, modulates the power range. Activation lessens the negative effects. Arcana. Makes rare enchantments more common. Ooh. I don't know what mod this is from. So we're not going to do any of that right now. <laughs> not right now. I got no idea what I'm getting into with that. Those mods kind of change some stuff. But now, put the book there. Shovel. That, that. There we go, novice spell book. Okay, where does that come from? I'll grab that real quick. Um, there we go. So, first spell book, potion of mana regeneration. Archwood logs, did that. Scribes table, ooh. Random tier one glyph. Glyph of cut. Sounds combat oriented. Whoa. There's a lot of branches there. Ooh, glyph of conjure mage light. Ooh, I got that. I think it's at the house. Wait. I had I had that already. Did I put it in one of the ones down here? No. Oh yes, I did. I did. Right here. Okay. So we got us some glyphs. So we put the spell book down. Ooh. Arm. Hang on. Can I unselect? How do I go about? Oh, I've not unlocked it. Oh. Okay. Okay. So touch, self, and projectile. So for that, I need a fletching table and an arrow. I wonder if doing one of these will unlock... Well, I mean, of course it would, but... Use the book on the table while sneaking. Your item will now contain that spell. Using manipulation essence will permanently hide the scribe spell. So I need parchment. So I need to find a mage bloom fiber. Mage bloom. Oh. I need to go back to the forest. Hey, bear. Oh. I'm sorry. I can't. I don't get bear hide. I can't make a rug. Maybe. 
Mage Bloom. How do I find Mage Bloom flowers? A few episodes ago, it was cattails. Now it's Mage Bloom flowers. Are they not in this biome? One would think that they would be. Mage Bloom seed. Horse gem. Ooh. Mage Bloom? Grown from seeds crafted. Oh. Yeah. How do I find source gem? Wait. Obtained by placing lapis or amethyst in an Im imbument chamber. I need to know what an imbument chamber is. I can make that. Okay. Copy that, chief. Okay, so we got the gold. We got the planks. Jump. Jump. Dot, dot. Too many. Okay. Now we got an imbument chamber. So that can go here. Oh. Come on. Really? Oh, I need to... Okay, so lapis or amethyst. So we place lapis in an imbument chamber. Crafting source gem. Add source nearby to increase craft speed. I don't know what that means, putting it nearby. Oh, I need to make an enchanting apparatus. Okay. <laughs> Ugh. So I need four of those. There's one. A enchanting apparatus. Oh. What is source stone? What is source stone? Oh. Add source nearby to increase craft speed. Do I just throw it? No. Every time I pick something up. Oh my goodness, it is. They don't like when I pick stuff up. There we go. So now if we place this here and then surround it by stone. Now we have source stone. Okay. Again, we need some serious sorting. Enchanting apparatus. And that, that, that doesn't stick to the wall. An arcane core. Okay. So I'm guessing this will stick to the wall. Okay, now it works. Now it works. No. Ah. Uh, do, 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 do. Wait. I have the mining dimension. Oh. <gasps> oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, I am so lucky. Arcane core. Place this. Place that. Then we have the enchanting apparatus, which... Pedestals? Yeah, I don't even know if this is supposed to work. I don't know if this is going to work with seeds in hand. Oh, I needed four. Whoa! Whoa! That was cool. Go plant this downstairs. I don't want to break it. That was a little bit expensive. See, that should have gone in the middle. But I don't know. Oh. It was so cool. It should have gone in the middle. But I don't know how to break it. I don't I don't know how to put spells in here. I don't know how to go through spells. Conjure Mange Light. I have that. But the question is, how do I put it in the book? And how do I access the book? That is what I want to know. It'd be nice to tell me what it does. <laughs> Open spell book. Not found. Oh! Do I... Wait. Controls. Keybinds. Okay. That's what it meant. Open spellbook. Ah, ha, ha, there we go. Projectile. Arm. Create. Do I need to create both? 
Fifth of touch. Oh. Whoa. Ooh. Ooh. like that. So that's projectile. Wait, did you see that? Watch. Watch the trees. That is cool! Oh my goodness, that is so cool. Does it hurt things though, does it? It does. How much damage? It didn't It didn't kill a squid. Uh-oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh. make these spells more powerful. I don't know how to add glyphs. That's the thing. Oh! Spell name. Blingy Pow. Blingy Pow. Okay, I get it now. Touch break. So now, oh, no way! That is still cool though. I mean, you can just. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Hang on, blingy pal. Where's blingy pal? There. Stop. How do I add it to the book though? Oh. I need it. All I needed to do was. Oh, oh. All I needed to do was click. Flip of cut. Oh, I learned it. <laughs> oh my goodness. I, I didn't. Oh. So if I just. Yes. Yes. Oh, I know what I'm doing. You there. This is gonna add it. This is gonna make it look so much cooler. You there. And I can I can throw them on the higher ones too, I think. Click right there. Yes! Oh yes! Oh yeah. Okay. This is really cool. What is that all the way up there? Oh, when you're when you're a certain distance. They start to not render. The lanterns look cool, but the lights look even cooler. What do we do next? I'm kind of at a loss. What do I What do? I do? Well, I guess that'll give me something to think about uh, for n the next episode. Yeah, since I can't really think of anything else to do for this episode, that'll give me something to think about for next episode. Um... So thank you everyone so much for watching. I hope you've had a wonderful day. Um, don't forget to click that subscribe button. And if you really liked it, uh, go ahead and click that like button. Um, don't don't forget to comment down below when you do subscribe. Um, or if you if you do subscribe, uh, so that your name can be added to the wall of Batarlesium. Yeah, thank you so much for watching to this point. Um, I hope you all have a wonderful day. Don't forget to smile more and goodbye.